Hi, and welcome to Fox Comics and Games in beautiful downtown Marion, Illinois. And we're unpacking this week's order of comics. And today is the 11th, and these comics go out for sale on Wednesday, December 12th. We're starting off with Superman Action Comics, issue 993. Uh, the new, you'll note the new DC Universe logo. Uh, very nice touch. Uh, next up from Dark Horse Comics is Aliens Dead Orbit. And this is issue number four. Then we have uh, all, all new Wolverine, issue 28 with the Marvel Legacy numbering. Amazing Spider-Man, issue 792. And that's part two of the Venom Incorporated. Take on that. And then we have from IDW, Angry Birds, uh, Monsters and Mistletoe, kind of their holiday edition. And that's a one-shot, but we have some of those. Uh, next up from Aftershock Comics is Animosity, number 11. Uh, they're really becoming the, the new image uh, comics. They're really putting out a lot of good books right now. Then we have from IDW, Back to the Future, issue 25. Pretty nice. DC's Batgirl and the Birds of Prey, issue 17, is up next. Then we have Ben Riley, the Scarlet Spider from Marvel. That's issue 11. From Valiant, which is really uh, doing stunning work right now, we have Bloodshot, uh, issue 4, and that's the standard cover. Then there is also the pre-order bundle cover for those of you that uh, pre-order them. Uh, nice book by Jeff Lemire. Marvel. Uh, Brings us Cable, issue 152 with the legacy numbering. From Image, we have Coyotes, issue 2. Pretty bizarre looking cover on that one. Then we have Marvel's Daredevil, issue 596. And staying in the Marvel realm, we have the Despicable Deadpool. And they tell you up front, this issue Cable dies, so... It looks like Deadpool kills Cable. Next up we have Detective Comics, Batman Detective Comics, issue 970. Uh, from Chapter House Comics we have Die Kitty Die Christmas Special, number one. Next up from Valiant Publishing is our vote for the best cover of the week, and that is Eternity. Issue 2, and that's from Matt Kent, and that is a stunning book. Next up from Marvel, we have Falcon, Issue 3. And then DC's Flash, Issue 36. Next up from DC as well, Gotham City Garage. That's Issue 5. Staying in D.C., we then go to Hal Jordan and the Green Lantern Corps, issue 34. There are variant uh, covers for almost all of these D.C. And, and most of the Marvel books that are out there. Next up is Invader Zim, issue 26. Marvel brings us Jean Grey, um, and that is issue 10 in the legacy numbering. And then next up from Dark Horse is Jenny Finn, and that's a, uh, from Mike Mignola. Very, very nice art, very, very nice book. Next up, we have Justice League of America from DC, issue 20. Again, variant covers available. Then Image comes in with a Kingsman Red Diamond, issue 4, uh, and that's a six-shot uh, total, so there's only two left after that one. DC is up next with Mr. Miracle. And you'll note that it is not part of the DC Universe as delineated by their logo. Next up, part of the DC Universe is the new Superman, issue 18. Uh, next up, from Image, a very good book, uh, Port of Earth, Zach Kaplan. He did Eclipse, for those of you who are wondering where you've heard of Zach Kaplan. The last book he was working on, I believe, was Eclipse. Marvel's The Punisher, uh, issue 219, part of the War Machine series. And DC 
DC Universe Red Hood and the Outlaws issue 17 and a nice variant cover available for that as well. Next up from Image we have Retcon uh, issue 4. And then from IDW we have some Samurai Jack and that is issue 3. Next up from the DC comic people, we have Scooby Apocalypse, uh, issue 20, part of the Scooby-Doo reimagining. Then we have SpongeBob, issue 75, one of Mr. Fox's favorite comics. Star Wars from Marvel, issue 40, uh, being written by Jason Aaron, very, very nice book. Suicide Squad from DC, issue 31 is up next. That looks pretty wild. Supergirl from DC, issue 16 is up. And then obviously next up will be Superwoman, issue 17 from DC. Then up next from IDW, uh, Sword of Ages. Um, kind of a sleeper hit, looks nice. That's issue one. Uh, very good looking comic. Next up from DC is Titans, issue 18. Then we have from DreamWorks, Voltron, the Legendary Defender, issue five. Marvel brings us Weapon X, issue 12. And it looks like some Christmas fun from Image. We have The Wicked and the Divine, the Christmas Annual. Next up from DC, we have Wildstorm, Michael Cray. Uh, and that is issue three. Again from DC, we carry Wonder Woman, issue 36, with some variant covers available for that as well. That's out this week. And then we have X-Men Blue, issue 17, from Marvel. And then we have, last but not least, from Image, Young Blood issue 7, is available from them. And we also have in a Wonder Woman maquette of Linda Carter uh, this week, and also a Dax and Groot statue, and some nice key rings as well. If you get a chance, come in and see us at Fox Comics and Games, Marion, Illinois. Thanks.